New data shows breakout cases make up nearly 7% of all COVID cases in San Diego County right now. These are cases where vaccinated people still got COVID-19. However, this version of the virus can look a little different. Shannon Handy went digging to find out why in this Verify report. You've probably heard that if you're vaccinated but still get COVID, your symptoms are less severe than someone who isn't vaccinated. But we wanted to look into reports that sometimes those symptoms are completely different. Our sources for this story are Dr. Joe Tusandu, a family medicine doctor with Sharpery Steely, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, and the Zoe COVID study. We asked Dr. Sandu, are the symptoms for a vaccinated person versus an unvaccinated person different? Yes, but not always. Everyone reacts differently to infections. Uh, some people may have certain symptoms while other people have other symptoms. For those who are vaccinated, the symptoms do tend to be milder. In regards to specific symptoms, the Zoe COVID study compiled data for more than a million users and came up with these two lists showing the top five COVID symptoms for each. For the fully vaccinated, headache, runny nose, sneezing, sore throat, loss of smell. For the unvaccinated, headache, sore throat, runny nose, fever, persistent cough. You'll notice some differences between the two. For example, for the vaccinated, a persistent cough isn't listed as a top five symptom. It is, however, for the unvaccinated, yet you don't see a loss of smell or sneezing. Those are also symptoms, just not among the top five. And those lists are not absolute. For example, I interview one man by foe who did not want to be identified. He's fully vaccinated and is currently recovering from COVID. It just started getting to be more congestion. Initially, he thought he had allergies. He never had a headache, but later his symptoms ranged from a low-grade fever to sneezing and losing his sense of taste. Yeah, it was interesting because Thursday I was cooking a pot of chili and I could smell it while I was making it. And then all of a sudden I went to taste it and all of a sudden I had no taste. So can you easily tell the difference? difference between COVID and the common flu or cold? No, this is something scientists all over the world continue to research. According to the CDC, because some of the symptoms of flu, COVID-19 and other respiratory illnesses are similar, the difference between them cannot be made based on symptoms alone. Testing is needed to tell what the illness is and to confirm a diagnosis. COVID tests are easy to access, but if you're still unsure about whether or not to get tested for COVID, the best advice they experts is to ask your doctor. A mild symptom such as just a stuffy nose could be COVID for you, but it may not be COVID for somebody else. And so once we have any types of symptoms, we have to be vigilant. Shannon Handy, News 8.